everybody. Welcome to another episode of Sweet Soulful Cooking with Lo. Uh, today we have something very simple and delicious. A vegetable. A cabbage. I got a medium head of cabbage here. We're going to smother, smother cabbage with uh, a fried four strips of bacon and I saved the grease from it. And then we're gonna saute a little onions, green peppers and garlic and cut this up, put it in there and let it cook for about 45, 50 minutes until it's tender. Put a little salt and pepper and uh, garlic powder on it, onion powder, and that's it. So I'm gonna show you how I prepare it. And uh, we're gonna cut this up. First of all, uh, what my mother used to always do, she would take the outer leaves off and cut these up, cut the, the darker leaves, and then cut the rest of the cabbage up, but chop the leaves on the outside. If you're lucky enough to get it, sometimes they pull them off at the grocery store uh, before you can get it, but if you get it at a farmer's market, if you're lucky enough, you have all the leaves, and it's uh, real dark in color and more flavorful. A cabbage uh, has a lot of vitamin C. A half a cup is about your daily requirements for uh, vitamin C. It also has vitamin A and K and uh, potassium and magne magnesium. Uh, so the easy, easiest way to cut the cabbage is straight down the head. Cut it into quarters. Like that. And I uh, usually cut the little core out of that on the tip. Don't need that, it's kind of hard. So it takes longer to cook. And you don't want to cook that. Maybe some people do, but I don't use it. So we're going to take that out. And the rest of this, uh, we're going to slice it up, wash it, chop this up fine. And uh, when we come back, we're going to do that and uh, put it in the pot and let it go for about 45, 50 minutes until tender. Very simple. We'll be right back. All right. Um, I'm going to show you the easiest way to chop this is you just chop it like that. I've done the others already. Uh, just go over it. Pretty much make it into... Uh, edible pieces and then throw it in some water and you're going to rinse that and wash it just rinse it the cabbage is pretty clean and with this that's the bigger leaves looks like a lettuce almost on it just chop it up and we're going to put that on the bottom after uh, the started before we mixed it all in because this gives it a little darker color when it cooks, get hot really fast, and then mix it in the rest of the, blend it in. So that's how you do it. We come back, we're gonna put it in the pot, saute the garlic, green peppers, and onions for a couple minutes, and then let this cook for about 45, 50 minutes until it's tender. We'll be back. All right, we're back. Um, we're doing something real simple and easy today. Cabbage, um, smothered cabbage. Um, I fried four strips of bacon and uh, saved some of the grease in there and the rest is in here. I'm gonna pour that over at the uh, end of this process right here. I have some uh, garlic, green peppers, and onions. I'm gonna throw that in there. Saute that for a few minutes so they get a little tender. Then we're going to put the green leaves in. And then we follow that with the cabbage. I got the cabbage all cut up, washed. This is smothered cabbage. Cabbage, you can fix it a lot of ways. You can stuff it. You can add sausage to it, corned beef, anything you like. A lot of different ways. This is a pretty simple way, smothered cabbage. Uh, 
good for vegetarians or just simple. Nothing extra, nothing fancy. And it's quick. All right, we got the onions and the peppers in there. Smelling good, fragrance. Gonna put the green leaves in first, chop them. Cabbage, uh, it's just like uh, spinach almost, it shrinks. And it shrinks down to nothing what it looks like when you put it in there. So we got that in there, the green leaves. Now we put the rest of the cabbage. We might add uh, about a quarter cup of water, but cabbage holds water, so. We just washed and rinsed, so it's going to be a lot of um, uh, liquid in it already, so you don't want it to be too much. So we got that in there. Let's season it a little salt and pepper. Don't want to put too much pepper. Pepper overpowers the flavor of uh, cabbage sometimes. If you put too much, it'd be too spicy. And uh, we add the uh, bacon dripping, add it by a quarter cup of water, put the top on this and let it go. When we come back, it'll be done. We're going to let it go 45, 50 minutes until it's tender. All right, we'll be back. Thanks for watching. Well, there you have it. Smothered cabbage. A little simple dish. Real simple. Good for vegetarians. Check it out. Another Sweet Soulful Day episode. Sweet Soulful Cooking with Lowell. Stay safe, everybody. Thanks for watching. See you next time.